Santos, the party, the Democratic Party, is this a healthy debate that's happening right now? Yeah, I think this is aspirational. This is actually popular. I mean, if Trump thinks is going to hurt us politically, he's absolutely uh, not really paying attention to the pulse of the country. This is aspirational. Like, like uh, you said, it's not a bill. The details would have to be worked out. And this is so ambitious that these details would have to be worked out over decades. This is a right. broad, uh, aggressive, bold agenda. And it'll take time to implement. But at least it shows people where the Democratic Party is going on the issue of climate change. You know, it was Yes We Can, but I'm wondering if now it's Yes We Can become a socialist country. And I know that it sounds alarmist. I know every it sounds for every election hang on a second. since but I know that the sounds, 60s. I know that sounds alarmist, but remember. Make America socialist for the first that, no time. What. Yeah, but I tell you what, that is. I, I think we're looking for dreamers at this point. I mean, Trump is going to accuse us of being socialist no matter what. It doesn't matter what the agenda is. He's going to use the same playbook. It didn't work in 2018. It's not going to work in 2020. And so I think it's important to really think aspirational is to give people a sense of where the candidate wants to be. Yes, we can is actually a very positive message as opposed to maybe Klobuchar or Sherrod Brown saying, no, we can't. And we all realize that the political process in the U.S. is slow. It's designed that way. Mm -hmm. So not a lot's going to get done, no matter who the president is, but who has that vision that can articulate what the Democratic Party is all about. And that's what's going to get people excited. You know